Mary just announced the Celebrate Erie lineup, some pretty well-known national acts. Talk a little bit about that. We're real excited about the, the acts for this year's uh, Celebrate Erie. Starting out with the Erie All-Stars, you know, that's a great local group. Yeah, local flavor. Local flavor. It's, it's wonderful to have them participating like for the sixth year now in a row. They're, they're playing a very important role. Uh, the other groups are obviously incredible, well-known. We're hoping this is going to draw a lot of families and people to downtown Erie to enjoy. I think we're going to start the shows a little bit early too, so they don't go quite so late. People can get home hopefully before dark this summer. So what, we're very excited about it. Was that kind of diversity and choice uh, part of the plan? Yes, it definitely is part of the plan. We decided what we wanted in terms of diversity before we even started to recruit bands. I should say before Aaron started, because he did all the work on this. What do you think people who come down here who maybe have been here in the past will notice that's different about the festival I under think, your administration? Yeah, the big thing is we're trying to make it much more locally focused, uh, local things, local artists, also more diverse. We, we're trying to get much more diversity into this year because Erie's a diverse community. We need to celebrate that. That's one of our biggest strengths. Okay.